Hmm, the happy doc student? Sounds like an oxymoron. Hello and welcome to the podcast that will help you put more joy in your doctoral journey. I'm your host, Dr. Heather Frederick, and in this trailer, I'll explain what this show is all about, who it is for, and why listen to me. The Happy Doc Student Podcast was born out of my experience, both as a grad student who cried herself to sleep more nights than I care to admit, and as a faculty mentor who has worked in doctoral programs for decades. Look, it's no secret that the doctoral process is a difficult one, but what breaks my heart is that somewhere around 50% don't finish, and those who do finish tend to have some pretty nightmarish stories. In fact, when I surveyed doctoral students who were at all different stages in their program and asked them to describe their experience in a word or a short phrase, they gave me many, and most I can't share here because, well, you may have kids listening, but I can sum up the essence of what they shared in words like mysterious, confusing, oppressive, overwhelming, intimidating, and stressful. Does it sound familiar? Well, I'm here to tell you that you can graduate with your sanity, health, and relationships intact. And quite simply, that's the goal of this show. So who is this podcast for? Obviously, given the title, it's for doc students, primarily in academic programs, but the content will resonate with faculty and staff who support doc students, whether you're a chair, committee member, or advisor. I would even venture to guess that people in other types of grad programs would find many of the shows useful. And if you're wanting to get a sneak peek behind the ivory curtain, maybe before you make a decision to start a doc program, then this show is sure to give you some info you aren't likely to find anywhere else. And chances are, if you're a friend or family member of a doc student, this podcast just might help you understand what the heck is going on with your loved one. And last but not least, why listen to me? Well, here's the Reader's Digest version. I'm a first-generation college student, and I received my PhD in psychology from Brandeis University in 1998. I've worked in doctoral programs for over two decades, teaching courses like research design and statistics. I've served as a chair on a whole lot of dissertations and doctoral projects, and I've sat on hundreds of committees. I've served as an academic reviewer for a number of universities. I've also taught both land-based and virtual residencies. I even had a stint once as a dean of a graduate school. During my career in higher ed, I worked my way to vice president of academic affairs only to leave it all after a life-changing event. I was gone for about five years, during which I explored many things that I considered quote-unquote off-limits for a PhD. Recently, I decided to come back to the academy, but this time with a mission. I believe we all have a purpose, and when we live in line with that purpose, our light shines. And if there is ever a time we need people out there shining their light, it is now. And if you're listening to this podcast, then probably getting your doctoral degree plays a role in your purpose. And this podcast exists to support you through this often challenging, frustrating, and lonely journey. Okay, now that's the short story. I have had students tell me that knowing what I went through was inspiring because they saw so much of themselves in my story, and I've also had faculty tell me that learning about my story gave them a new perspective when it came to chairing students. So in the next episode, I'll give you the extended dance version. But for now, let me just share my plan. These first few episodes are going to be solo shows where I record just myself sharing some things that I think really lay the groundwork. But after that, I'll be inviting guests to come on the show and share academic wisdom and or esoteric insight with the goal of helping you relieve some of the pain inherent in the doctoral process. But what's most important to me is that I am delivering things that you want and that you need. Otherwise, it's just me recording the podcast for the crickets. So to that end, I invite you to download an article I wrote called The Doctoral Journey, 12 Things you need to know that they probably won't tell you. Now, when you download this article, you'll be invited to participate in a free seven-day email adventure. 
These emails were the result of students asking me to help them get clarity and rekindle some much needed motivation. Now listen, I know you're busy, but I promise you that these short emails will help you kickstart your journey no matter where you are in your program. And when you start that adventure, you'll have my email. So I invite you to connect with me and let me know your pain points. I promise I'll do my best to help or find someone who can. I guess that about wraps this one up. I'll see you in episode one. The Happy Doc Student Podcast is brought to you by expandyourhappy.com and you can learn more there. Oh, and hey, if you want to make my day, would you rate, review, and subscribe to this show? Thank you.